Hi, welcome to Smooth Jive. We're Jim and Nikki, and today it's routine nine. So we're going to be teaching you the first move whip, the tango flick, and the accordion Manhattan. Okay, we're going to do a slight change to the format. Um, we quite like the way we did our wedding video, so we're going to do a demo first, then we're going to do a walkthrough of the routine, and then we're going to do a detailed teach at the end. So depending on your level, mm -hmm. you might just see the demo and get it straight away, or you might want the detailed teach at the end. So. Demo first, this is what it looks like. Seven, eight. Away. This is the whip with a turn. We had a traveling return. Then we go a one, two, in, flick, turn, and a one, two, and out. Okay, so that's the demo. Even I'm dizzy with that one. <laughs> okay, so that was a demo. We're now gonna go a walk through, so it's fairly quick. If you don't get it in on this bit, go to the detailed teacher at the end. So here we go. It's a left to right move. We start off by leading our partner away. I'm going to step out of the slot with my left foot, creating space on my right hand side. I'm then going to lead Nikki down the slot towards me. As I do, my right hand is going to go under Nikki's forearm onto the shoulder blade. And I'm going to turn her out. So she's going to step back on the right foot. As Nikki steps back on the right foot, what I'm doing is I'm pivoting on my right foot, stepping across the slot, changing hands to palm to palm with this hand. My right hand is going to literally pull on Nikki's which shoulder? left shoulder blade, left shoulder blade yeah. to pull her back down the slot as I raise my left hand. Nikki's going to do a one and a half turns, lower and back. Now, as Nikki steps back, I'm stepping out of the slot again to create space. We're going to do a traveling return because Nikki's done two turns. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Traveling return. That allows me to pick up the spare hand. So we're now going palm to palm. Nikki's back on the right foot. And I'm going to step Nikki two steps. So it's a one. Forward on the right. Then on the left. Then I can wrap Nikki into my side. So whilst I'm, I'm in the slot and facing Nikki, I have to turn sideways on, but I can't do it in this position. As I raise my left hand to wrap Nikki in, so Nikki's turning anti-clockwise, I then turn sideways, make sure we're touching all the way down our body, side to side. I lower, take my left foot out, and take Nikki just off balance. Okay, so ladies, what you're going to do and feel that you're going to want to do is when the guy leans you, your right leg kind of comes across and does this little flick. Okay, so what I've done is actually I've, I've touched the floor and flicked it like that. So it should happen in one go. So flick and we go straight back up. So I raise the left hand. Nick is going to turn clockwise underneath. We keep hold with both hands. So left hand stays high. Nikki keeps turning. Your, which hand is that? It's my left arm. Left hand behind the back. Now, when Nikki comes around the face, you'll want to step back on her right foot. And I'll go forward on my left. And we go one and two and three for a Manhattan. And then I'm going to pull with my right hand to send Nikki back down the slot, like so. Letting go with the right hand, turning Nikki anti-clockwise, one and a half turns, lower and back. Okay, so that's the walkthrough. Now for a more detailed teach. So... We start off face to face in the slot. I'm going to use the back of my hand to lead Nikki away as I step out of the slot to my left on my left foot. My weight's on my left foot, creating space on my right hand side for Nikki to go down. Now, my right hand is, is ready to go under Nikki's far arm and hold on to the shoulder blade. The shoulder blade for this move is key. So as I start to pivot Nikki out, so you're pivoting on the... I'm going back, I'm pivoting on the left foot, going back on the right. I'll go through the footwork in a moment, ladies, for you. So I'm going to pivot on my right foot, like so, come across the slot, okay? Now, th there's a little bit of tension as Nikki goes into that back position, and I use my right hand as a spring to pull Nikki as I come across the slot like so and start to turn Nikki in a clockwise direction. Okay, and it's a one and a half turn. Remember guys, it's our responsibility to make sure that 
the, the hand that we turn our partners on is always above our partner's head. Okay, so don't spin from over here, spin on top of your partner's head. So, so if I can go over the footwork for you ladies. So it's, it's a lead away. So you go back on the right foot as uh, your guy brings you in for the first move. You step forward on the right, pivot on the left and back on the right. And that's where you stay until what's going to happen with the whip part of the move. As Jim pulls me, I'm literally stepping, uh, my weight goes on my left foot and then I step right, left, right, left, and I'm back. So I'm doing that one and a half turns, but I'm walking as I'm going through. So it's not a spin on the spot. And the, just to get the, the beats for the, the guys when they do the whip. So you're out on one, you collect on two, three is where we both step. So this is beat three and we've both stepped. Four is the start of the turn and then However many other beats that is, so I don't know. <laughs> so, um, yeah, let's try it to a count. Here we go. Just that move. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, and six. Remember, you're stepping out of the slot on the end of the move. Okay, so don't stay in the middle. Let's try it again. Let's see, try it from this side. Here we go. Five. Six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, and six. And I'm out of the slot. Okay, one more time from this side. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four, five, and six. Okay, let's yeah. add on the rest of the move. Where on earth did we finish? Oh, yes, back. Tra travelling yes. return. So, so I'm we finish such that Nikki stepped back. I'm now going to do a travelling return. So this stops Nikki throwing up from dizziness. <laughs> okay, so travelling return is very simple. Send Nikki down the slot. I raise my left hand over Nikki's head. Nikki turns anti-clockwise. But importantly, as Nikki starts to pass me, I run my right hand down her forearm to collect. And we end up palm to palm and I'm back in the slot. I'm back on the right foot. So, yeah, Nikki's back on the right foot. So, naturally, Nikki's body's slightly turned, so her right. Right, right hand is slightly further away from me, and the left hand is nearer to me. So, I can now walk Nikki by going one... Right foot. ...and two. Left foot. Okay. So, I'm still facing Nikki, but I need to go sideways on. So, as I raise my left hand... Your left hand turns in your partner's hand, you end up going palm to palm there. Turn Nikki anti-clockwise, keeping the right hand low. And we end up going side to side very naturally, like so. We lower the left hand. Now we're going to turn and show you what this looks like, so stay there. Very important with side to side, like so. So not, not here, you're literally side by side, just to show you from this side. Side by side, like so. And... Ideally, you want your right foot to connect with your partner's left foot, okay? We're hip to hip touching, and I use my, my peck <laughs> here against Nikki's shoulder. <laughs> and then... I forgot he can see me in the TV. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I did see that. Love so, you. <laughs> okay, hands low. And all we do is we take our partner off balance, okay? So this is it's not as big a lean as you think, okay? What you don't want to do is stretch your left leg all the way out there and try and do something ridiculously big. So, ladies, what I said earlier was naturally your right foot... Well, this is how we evolved this move. I wanted my right foot to kind of do a little flick in front. So a little tango flick. So what I've done is I actually just graze the floor as I go along. So as Jim leans me, I kind of feel like I just want to do a little flick and I'm back up again. Okay, from here, we raise the left hand. We're still palm to palm. Right hand stays low and we keep hold with the right hand. Nikki's turning clockwise and keeps turning until her left arm goes behind her back like so, comes round to face. We lower the left hand. We keep hold with both hands. Nikki will now want to step back on that right foot. I need to step with my left. And we do what's called a Manhattan. So 
I'm moving only my left foot, my right foot stays where it is. And I'm doing the opposite, so my left foot stays where it is and my right foot moves. Okay, you do as many of these as you want, okay? It's not a rule that says you have to do three and then you go on. Okay, so you do a few of these. When you're happy, you have to be in the forward position. So your left foot forward in order to exit the move. Because then, as Nikki goes to step forward, we pivot like so. Pull with the right hand, raise the left, keep the left hand over our partner's head, let go with the right to turn our partner's anti-clockwise, lower and step back, and that is the end of the routine. Well done. So, we're going to count you in, do the beats to the whole routine. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and nineteen. Yay! No, no way, it's going to be nineteen beats the second time round. <laughs> never mind. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, two. Three and four, five and six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and yes. nineteen. <sighs> Always happy when the beats do <laughs> when the beats end up being the same both times. It makes me very happy. As you know us, it doesn't happen very often. <laughs> so, one more time. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. And away. And whip, turn, travel and return. Collect, one and two. Whip, turn, and. Let's do a few of these, just to show you that you can do a few more. And exit. And we're done. Okay, if you like that move, please tell all your friends, like, subscribe and share, and uh, get my teeth back in, <laughs> and we'll see you for the next one. Thanks all. Bye.